G'day viewers. Okay, so it's been a while since I've um, filmed anything. I've uh, been very busy, changed jobs, working Saturdays now, so I don't get much time to, uh, to ride. So I just thought I'd do this uh, quick little video just to um, reinforce that I am still here and I appreciate everyone's comments on videos and all the subscriptions thank you very much now firstly I've had quite a few um, questions and um, comments on the Bluetooth Blue Rider intercom system now just quickly I've uh, given that the flick uh, some of you may have read my um, answers to some questions uh, I'm still happy to help on it as much as I know on it um, But just quickly I, I bought eight units uh, three of them failed Tried to contact the seller which I, I bought them through eBay um, It proved to be a very very lengthy difficult communication process so at the end of the day I decided to count my losses um, not use them and buy in just invest in, in, in buying a, a, a good unit so I ended up buying the um, Scala Rider Pack Talk unit me and a mate bought the um, the package that comes that comes in two so we went halves basically it cost me around I don't know 300 to 350 bucks um, so around the $700 mark for, for the for the dual packaged unit a really good unit not an issue I haven't really had time to um, get into the nitty-gritties of um, all the functionality and everything so when, when I do that um, I'll, I'll post up a bit of a bit of a video secondly I've replaced my camera I was using my um, center prism tube and the camera that you see now is the drift ghost X just felt like I needed something a bit better Uh, so I've changed to that one. I'm still going to use the prism tube and in between all that I also bought the um, SJ Cam uh, SJ Cam SJ6 Legend which uh, to be honest I can't remember if I've posted up any videos with it um, but good camera films really good but the problem with it was the battery life. Battery life was just ridiculous. It was like half an hour. I had four batteries and it was just a pain in the butt to be honest. Um, so I've done away with that. Again I'm probably, I'm, I don't know, I'm probably going to keep it um, just to do other things with it. Thirdly, um, I bought myself uh, a new state-of-the-art five WFX Max gloves fantastic gloves a little bit bulky a little bit getting used to but not too bad but what happened with them is the lining came out and there was holes in the tips of the fingers on the I can't remember left or right glove I can't remember uh, but the lining is not supposed to come out and obviously not supposed to get holes in it so I've actually taken it back to the place of purchase which I'm going to now now I did ask them I did ask them if I could swap them for because the, the, the manufacturer actually agreed uh, to replace them under warranty so I got a call from the store saying yep we've got a, a pair here just come and pick them up but my question to them was can I actually swap them for a different model 
Now I'm not 100% sure if the model I want, which is the WFX1, it's still a waterproof model, uh, but just doesn't have a lot of the bulk. Um, still plenty of protection, but not a lot of the bulk. And they said yes. So they, that's fantastic through them. Um, so they said, they called me yesterday actually, and they said, yeah, we, we've got them in. Um, and they, they've agreed that I can test them out. Um, I'm not obliged to buy them, but I can compare the two. So they've got the, the new WFX Max ones that I had, and they've got the other model that I requested. So I can basically, I can basically uh, test them out and compare the two and take the ones that I um, that I want. I don't know if there's any price difference with the new ones, but we'll sort that out. I'm happy to pay a little bit more, or they said they're happy to refund the difference. So we'll see how we go with that. So yeah, just a quick video, guys. Um, great to be back on the bike. Great to be talking through the camera and um, talking to you guys. So I hope you enjoy this little video and rest assured that I'll be making more, not as frequently as, as frequently as I was, but definitely still doing some. I'm actually doing a, um, next week I'm heading off to the superbikes and then heading straight from the track to up north by uh, the coast road through Gippsland and um, the far south coast of New South Wales all the way up to the central coast. Uh, I'm hoping to do some, some filming while I'm doing all that, that whole trip on with all this new gear. So thanks guys. Thanks again everyone for subscribing and commenting and everything. Really appreciate it. And um, all the best to everyone. Nice to talk to you again. See you in the next one.